Okay. And I'm telling and your claim is that within that period, 12 battles took place? Yeah. What's your evidence? So is that because of that, therefore, is the word of Allah? Did 12 battles take place in yes, that time? Did, did, yes, I don't think there's a during, single historian during, that will say, between the six to nine year period, 12 battles took place. Yes, absolutely. And give me one peer reviewed evidence that proves this, please. I will bring it to you next week. I'm not oh, but you've made the claim, though. That's all right, yes, I will bring it. I said it. I'm not prepared okay. for it yet. Because I'm go telling to the you, next one. I've studied this. Okay, go I'm to the next one. There was never war, yes? Yeah? So this is has been debunked, yeah? No. I'm not saying that. I'm saying, I'm saying when the Byzantines were losing, they lost Jerusalem, yeah. Constantinople, yeah. Egypt. In one go, in many wars. No, no, in that in particular many, battle. In one, one in go. In that battle. Right. Yes. In that battle, how yeah. many days? Yeah. Was it, is it, did it take years, months? How, how many? Yeah, those, they, they would last an incredibly long period. Exactly. So. No, but, but here's the thing now. They lost all of these places. Heraclius was shamed. A plague broke out. For you to say Thank now that they recovered, nice between six to nine years they had 12 battles and after that 12 battle I'm not period, saying recovered I'm saying they very had unreasonable. at least 12 wars between we, them that's the right? no problem and Muhammad oh, is not to... specifying which one you understand the prophet from his time said from this time yes. six to nine years yes the Byzantines will beat the Persians so okay so what the, the, the time that they've lost now, what do you think it? about this I'm just saying the time it's that amazing no sir you're impressed no of course you are because you said yourself prophecies yeah. don't come with time no during that time they had many times war ladies and gentlemen yeah, so no one of evidence, them ladies and gentlemen no evidence all right all right go to give the next one, one. Right, just go, one just one go to the other one give me a weak evidence i haven't got any, any no evidence at the moment i will bring Debunked. the next okay you you consider that okay no do you consider it because you brought no i evidence. said i will bring okay, you evidence let me give you evidence then. Right. i'll give you evidence I'll give you a Christian source, yeah. not a Muslim source, okay. because I don't want to fall in circular reasoning, yeah? Chronicles of Theophanes. Okay. He verified that exactly when the Prophet said six to nine years, no, I'm the, not saying no, I'm saying defeated. how many wars did they have that time? Look, I'm saying in that period, Say. it's not possible to have 12 battles. They only All had right, one. So we will find out then. I will bring you I'm the... I'm telling you, Chronicles maybe. of Theophanies, Oh. This is a primary I'm source of evidence. I'm not saying it's incorrect. I'm saying how many wars did they have during that time? None so other than the one. one. All right, move on. That's then. what I'm okay. saying. That is how one. Yeah. It's okay for you to be impressed. The Romans defeat the, uh, exactly. Thank you. No, I'm asking you. You said there was 12. Yeah, that, that, that's what I said. I will Romans go and find that for him. He's picked up only one. But Persian have yeah. won many times also. During that, I will bring that. From that's the time of the prophet's prophecy, to the six to nine year period, only one took place. Right. One, one battle war, took yes. place. Only one I will took find place. that, no problem. Yeah, only one major battle took place in which oh. the Byzantines beat the move Persians. On. Come on. Yeah? What, what's the but next? what do you think about that now? I said I will bring you detail as this and gentleman that's fine, said something very nice. I want to know nice. your opinion because you said number one, the dates are not normally given. People use circular reasoning. I haven't used circular reasoning, I've given you an objective source, Chronicles okay. of Theophanies. I've given you a time period and that uh, the Quran, Sir, I can give you manuscripts. You say it between give you, listen, listen, six listen, listen, to listen. nine years. Listen, yes? listen, listen. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. Because I can now give you carbon dated manuscripts that date the Quran when it was written okay. to the time of preservation. All right. So is, this is now your what, next one. Yeah. Now, what do you think about this? Okay. So where is that? Where is that? No, no, no. What do you think about what I said? Listen, Let's have a human interaction. I, that's what I'm saying. Are you impressed? Yes, yeah, very impressed. Thank but you. where is it? Where is that piece? Well, where's the wall? The no, no, no. You said carbon dioxide. Yeah, yes? University of Birmingham. So how many pages? There's four folios. Four, yes. So it, it dates to that period, yes? Yes, when carbon dated okay. by the University of Oxford. But that doesn't it's prove it's dated. the word of Allah, ladies know, and gentlemen. That's not what I'm saying. What do you say? I'm still talking about the battle argument that I'm saying. Oh, you still Romans, on that? I'm giving you, I'm giving you supporting evidence. I gave you a primary source evidence. Yeah, okay, I said now I will bring you manuscript you details. evidence. I will bring and you, you said you were impressed, yeah? Yeah, very good, okay, thank, you. Right, thank so you. So what is your next support? Supporting for? The Quran what? being voracious, yeah? Yeah, you said that uh, because there was a prophecy. 
Yeah, prophecies in the Quran. Yeah. yeah. And lack of contradictions. No contradiction in the Quran. No contradiction in Quran. There is no contradiction in Quran. My brother. No. So no contradiction in Quran. No. No. Is that what you say? Yeah, yeah. So if you bring contradiction, bring it. yes, you can attempt to bring contradiction. Yeah. Okay. What is contradiction? What do you mean by contradiction? So a contradiction is when you have one thing that goes completely against the other thing, and when you take the context of the whole book into consideration, there's 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 no uh, solid evidence to satisfy that contradiction. All right. So if there's an apparent contradiction, you sir, you look in the Quran to get a bigger picture and if the picture is not satisfied by the Quran or the Hadith then that would be a contradiction. Like, okay. Like your image today is a contradiction of you. That's fine. So because of that there is no contradiction therefore is the word of Allah. Is that what you're saying? Yeah because if something comes no, from God. No yes or no yes? So if something comes from God it shouldn't have contradiction. Okay but is this the no God no Allah we're talking about Allah here. Sorry? Is this the word of Allah because we couldn't find any contradiction? Yes, if something Quran comes from God, it shouldn't have contradiction. No, God, you say Allah. No, 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 don't say God. Allah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really? Say it, please. Say what? Allah, Allah. Yeah, Allah. Don't do it, don't do it. That's what it's so No, it's no, not. No, 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 no. Don't, 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 don't do it. So, if a book came from someone other than Allah, then there would be contradictions in it. Okay, that, um, okay Allah, yes? Yeah, Allah. But how do we know it's from Allah? The, there are a few indicators and you're asking for indicators. When the book comes, you analyze the prophecies, you look at the contradictions. I've said it, I've accepted it, but how do we know it's from Allah, no, no, no. not don't, from another God? Don't just wait for your time to speak. First, listen to my answer. Then you want to refute it, refute it. But let me make the point first. But Zishan, you're repeating. I'm not. Okay. So the Quran, let's just say there is a book. First, if the book is making a claim, that was what the brother was saying, yeah? That, that the Quran is making the claim that it is from God. So the claim is in the Quran. Now you need to analyze that claim. Does it come from God? Yeah, what's the criteria for it to come from God? Well, what does the Quran say? There are prophecies in the Quran. Okay, the structure of the Quran. There have to be miracles. There have to be something special, okay. miraculous nature within the Quran that an average minded individual this is the criteria by yeah, whom? These set. are the criteria. Okay, by set, that, set by whom? So there are certain criteria that are mentioned yeah, in the Quran. Quran. There are certain. This on top of the science book. Is that right? There are certain it's criteria. Right. Don't be, look, there are people getting hungry, dying, and you concerned with this. What are you saying? Yeah, so there are certain what you're criteria that's mentioned in the Quran. There are certain criteria. He said it goes both together, yeah. hand in hand. Certain criteria. So the fact that he couldn't read and write. But that is a proof in itself. Have you, and written, it, man. Yes. Have you seen how he's written? Use that. Yeah. All, right. Use that. Yeah. all the humans and all the genes together. So there are certain I logical, can, I have. There are certain logical you criteria. Let me, I'm talking with this like knowledgeable man here. Yeah. You can write a book that's just like the Quran. Yeah. Then, okay, then prove it to us, please. There you go, yeah. Science, science book. Really? That's yeah, better than Quran. So there are certain logical criteria that are passed as brother. Yes! There are certain logical yeah, criteria. <laughs> there, there are certain criteria that are mentioned in the Quran. And yeah, when you have these uh, and you couple them together, you get certain criteria. For certain but people, who, their criteria who sets might be less. the criteria, Zishan? I've just answered you. There are certain criteria. So people are interrupting. There are certain criteria that are in the Quran, and that criteria in the Quran is logically underst understandable from us. Oh, so it's based on crowd it's, wisdom, yes? It's based upon reason and logic and common sense. So, okay, so, okay, give me your first premise for your reasoning and logic. Of what? The criteria you Okay, so if I was talking about contradictions, correct? I was talking about That's contradictions. No, criteria. Who yeah, sets so one of the, the criteria. criteria. Well, criteria for the infallibility of the Quran. Yes, that, that because yeah, no, this is the word of Allah. Okay. This is the word yeah, of Allah. Yeah, so some people they will come to the park. Oh, some people will come to the park and they only have two, three criteria. Has your friend come? Some people will have more criteria. So criteria is subjective. Yeah. to each individual just like evidence is subjective okay yeah some people require physical evidence some people require emotional evidence some people tell require me about just yours then. tell me about your if it's subjective well, well i would demonstrate your subjective well i would say experience. yeah i would say that if the if it was other than if a book came from something other than god okay then 
Allah, use Allah, don't say God, please. Yeah, God, Allah, yeah. Uh, sorry, Allah, no, no, but problem. in Quran says Allah, never I says God, yeah? Mind, no problem. Yeah. It says Rab. Yeah, am I right? It says Thank Rab. You. Rab as well. Rab, okay, oh, use. No problem, yeah. Use the one that Allah is no known problem. by. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. No we'll do that, no worries. <laughs> so, I have a question on that for you, by the way. Yeah, let's sorry. stick with one combo because we oh, lose our train of thought. You know, yeah, so when you're looking at... Con uh, no, you were going to yeah. give me your subjective experience. Yeah, so I'm saying that if creative. somebody says, somebody comes to the park, somebody comes to the park... Faulty analogy. Not necessarily. Yes, not necessarily. somebody, we know that somebody. No, but, but you haven't let me finish. If no, me because finish, it's faulty, how no, can you, I... You'll, you'll actually agree with that. If someone comes to the park and they say, I believe I have a book from God, it's the Vedas. Somebody comes to the park and says, I have a book from God, it's the Bible. Somebody comes to the park and says, I have a book from God, it's the Quran. Is that a faulty analogy? No, so it's You're not. comparing it with what? Sorry, I'm, I'm comparing it with the three claims that all three books are from God. So I would so challenge is, them differently. Yeah, so the point that I'm saying, because you're yeah. asking my criteria is, my first question would be, amongst other questions, is your book the same that it was when it was revealed? Is it preserved? Okay. Does that make sense to you? When you say preserve, what yes. do you mean by preserve? Exactly the same exact. as it was when it was Okay. Removed. Exactly. Does that make sense? No, it doesn't. I will okay. I will so challenge you. The word you. of God can I be changed. Yes. No. Make a mouth. The word of God is, I thought you would have considered this point quickly. No, sir. It's given to whom this word? Whoever is given to is given. Well, okay, we thank believe you. it's Whoever, given to a yes. prophet. That's to a prophet. Right. To a we messenger go, we, of God. Messenger of God. Yes. And what did messenger of God do? Sorry? What did messenger of God they do with the, the word message. was given? Yeah, so they convey it to the people. To the people, yes. And what happened In then? In its exact form. In exact form, yes. So what happened then? Then they convey it to the people. In so the don't, don't they write it down? Well, that's ah. no, but here's the distinction. I've now. got you. You did it because you just. I I was actually thinking you were going to bring better arguments because there's a distinction between Christianity and Islam. Forget that. No, the word was given to Muhammad. No. Yes. Because the Quran was memorized from cover to cover, beginning to end, the Bible was not. The Bible is a Forget bookish, about my, I'm not Bible, Christian. The, I'm not Christian. The Bible is a bookish religion which had to be written down. You correct what you're saying, I agree. Yes, yes. Because it's the word of Allah, yes? Yeah. The, Bible the Bible is different, no, yes. They, but the Bible believes it's divine as well. Divine, but yes. not the word of Jesus. No, but they if don't it's divine, claim that. But if it's divine, it's the word of God, no? No, that that's different. Sir. Doesn't, it have, doesn't it have. No, the word origins? is more important or the. They speak, I don't know how they have uh, godly origins. Okay. First, let's and stick both with need yours. To be preserved, yes. So. The word is coming by an angel, yes? You say. Yes. I give you all these things. These are challengeable for, just for the sake of argument. Yes? And what does I want to understand prophet the, do? I want to understand what does the, the preservation though. Yeah, now come into it, yes. Yeah. What does the pro prophet do with this revelation? Is that revelation you call? Yeah, so he memorizes it and then he conveys it to others. To others and they memorize. But they never yeah. write them they down? They memorize and they wrote it down. Thank you. So they wrote it down with his timing? Yes. Uh, his yes? Time, yes? Okay, thank you. So you're not going to disagree with what I'm going to say in a minute, yes? I don't know, you haven't said Thank it. you. So you see, I can't quote you again. Say it louder. Say it louder. Come here, you come there. Point. Say louder. I need to open. So, Maha, who, who Maha. would, Maha? who would verify, who would verify? Maha, what, what, what did you say, Maha? I was going to Muhammad, sorry. Okay. Who would verify Muhammad's revelations, you know, Quranic, Saying, no who would verify, please? Everybody. Jibreel you, alayhi salam. No, Jibreel sir. alayhi salam in the months of Ramadan. Ahi. Come on, give it to him. No, 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 sir. No, no, They've no, written no. it down. Yes. yes. They have written it down. They have written it down. Yes. Right. Yes. Who would see? You know the dictation you give yes. to your child or brother or someone. Yes? yes. You're a teacher. You used to be a teacher, and you would do the correction. Yes. Yes. Am I right? No, make the point, yeah. So, Muhammad has given this and people have memorized it. Now they're writing it then down, yes? yes? So who would say, oh yes, that is correct, tick, move to the next verse and so on. Who would say that? The scholar, the, the Ijma. No, sir, I'm talking about that time. And I'm answering you, the Ijma. 
No, it's my, I could not do it. Muhammad has to do it. Or Allah has to verify correctly written. You're not making sense. So the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is reciting the Quran. Yeah? The Quran is being written down. Yes. As it's written down, there are at least two witnesses yes. that are seeing yes. that companion write it down. Right. The companion then recites it back to the Prophet. Okay. There are other companions that can read. There are other companions that can read it. The Prophet is listening. The companions are reading it in Salah. The Prophet is hearing. The other companions are hearing. If as a collective, they are all hearing it, that is Ijma. That is the definition of Ijma. Correct. But who is writing them down? The companions, plural. I know, but who is verifying? The How do we know companions are writing that. something different? I just is it valid this question or not? Give you an answer. But you didn't ponder but upon the answer. Zishan, is, is it possible? You, you're a logical person. You understand possibilities and probabilities. Lula, yeah? listen, listen. Let me challenge you on this. Lula, the, the point that you've made, I want to answer the point first and right. remember the point that you're saying. I don't want to... Because I forget. Okay, uh, you said possibilities. yeah. And probability. Okay. We will go with that. Okay. So when it came to this point, you said, who is verifying it? Now, I knew you were going to come with this and I immediately gave you a response. Yeah, but you didn't have time to process it. Let me repeat it again. The I prophet, said I accept it. The Prophet is reciting it. The companions are writing it Correct. and reciting Correct. it. Correct, I've said that, yes. yeah, yeah. Now there are certain companions that are seeing at least two as the companion is writing it, they are verifying that he is writing exactly that which he has heard. Okay. He is now reciting it in prayer, in Ramadan and the Prophet is hearing and witnessing all of this taking place. Indeed, I know the point that you're going to say, the Prophet was unlettered. How could he double check what's written? But what I'm saying is that there were enough people that could read or write, that had come from different areas, different families, that could have verified right. and could have said that's a mistake there. Right, and if you. that companion is now reciting it to the Prophet, the Prophet could say that's a mistake. Okay. And they had, there were so many different manuscripts and they had to corroborate. So you telling well. me these things as if you you were there, yes? You witness all these things. Yes? Is that how it is? Yes. You see how you beautifying and glorifying all these logic. Well, that's how we talk right. about history. Isn't Tell it? me what is the difference? All right. Possibilities and probabilities. Yes. Tell me what is it? You tell me you're the one that brought it up. I don't know. No, but do you understand possibilities and probabilities? Yeah, they're pretty much um, synonyms of each other. Yeah, but what does it mean? You tell me. What how is the pos possibility? Are you, are, you, are you using in a philosophical sense? No, you using mathematics. You, I'm using mathematics. Okay, go ahead. Tell, tell me, me what is it? What does it mean? Possibility or probability? To you, yeah. What does it mean? It's a. I don't know. I would have. Thought, I would have thought it's a synonym of each other. Like, what's the chance of something happening? Okay, what is it? What's the chance of something happening? Well, you measure that, isn't it? Okay, by what? Well, it depends. If you're doing something, if you've got data, yes. you can use data to measure it, okay. or you can use sociological study to uh, to measure it. That's what I'm saying. I want to know. Okay, what, uh, so what is probability then? Uh, okay. You can just make your point. I feel like I'm just defining so just say I don't know then, yeah? Well, if you're going to use it as part of your argument, I need to know how you're okay. defining it. Would you say possibility, would you say, if you say possibility means 50-50, something would happen, 50 chance happen, 50 chance might not happen? Would no, you accept that possibility? That's a gross simplification of saying something's 50-50. Okay, you tell me then, what is it? Because something could be 1 out of 10, something could be 2 oh, out of 10. Thank you. So that is, you're going to probability now, yes? Okay, that, look, because you're going to use this in your <laughs> argument, I want you to tell me. I am, yes. to, I am listen, I'm, I'm, that's what I'm doing. I said, would you accept? When they say possibility, something is possible, is 50-50. Do you accept that? No. Why not? Because possible could be... Uh, 40, 60. So that is called probably highly unlikely or highly not unlikely. That's probability. Probability, Certain yes. So, but what likely, is possible? Uh, unlike, uh, likely. So above 50 is yeah. likely, yes? Yeah. The more, the, that's, the, the, that's a primary school graph, but yeah. But you fine. didn't say it. Yeah, so the fine, more, the higher we go towards 100 is higher probability. Yes. 
possibility, no the below you go is less probability, yes? How's it going? You okay, yeah? <laughs> yeah, you, you, you both have magnificent beards. Oh, thank you. Both of us. <laughs> one's real, one's not. <laughs> no, mine is genuine. Do you have one underneath it? Wait a minute, Makes respect. Yeah. Do you, yes, yes. It's yes. A nose. Thank you. Yeah. All right, thank you. Right, is everything you say fake? Um, no one. Look, you disrespecting this knowledgeable man. If you stand here, you would learn a thing, and you respecting your people. So, sir, so we understood. So, is it possible that they may have written something different? Forget about the explanation you gave me. There were two, four people there, two people here, and so on. Is there a possibility that? That they have written something wrong. Sociologically, no. But they have read, they have no. read it out. No? No, because we believe that the, okay. the quotations of the Quran are mutawatir. So, ladies and gentlemen, he said no, yes? You're sure? There was, it's not possible, yes? It's not possible. So, why did Osman... The Mutawati, yeah? Yeah. Why did Osman, Osman, burn down many, many Qurans? He didn't burn many, many Qurans. He burned, there's a difference between parchment and papyri. Papyri are stuff that are temporary. The parchment is something that... Last the test of time. And Uthman the Allah one who he didn't say word of Allah. Uthman. We are talking about word no, no, of no, no, Allah, no, no, no. not parchment. Justification. Are, are, Ladies and gentlemen, no, 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 no. he's the trying to justify. Allah, the word of Allah is the word of Allah, but when it's okay. written down, yes. you can't now say that that is uh? that's that's the writing of the people. Ah yes. that, that, so you came to me then now. Not possibility. Possibility. No, because the point that I used and you you signed up this point very quickly. Actually, no, you didn't take it seriously, which was mutawatir. Man of the Allah no, didn't burn the mutawatir. Okay, uh, what does mutawatir mean? Mutawatir means there are so many different chains. Chain of what? Uh, of narration. Quran. He means Quran. No, mutawatir, uh, narration. Narration what? The chains, the chains. Narration of who? Chains of narrations of companions. That no, 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 we're talking about Quran. We're not talking about yes. stories. And where is the Quran coming from? It's coming from the narration of the people. So why would this man burn? Yeah, he's so many of that them. which is not mutawatir. Narration, yes? Yes. So na is, is it Quranic? Writ written down Quranic, yes? Quranic. Yeah, written down manuscripts. Quranic? Of, yeah, Quranic. Yeah. Quranic. Yeah. So, word of Allah. That's not the word of Allah. Ah, so you, I've got him, ladies and gentlemen. So, if it's not word of Allah, therefore they have defeated. You didn't let me finish. They have defeated. You have to be here. You didn't let me finish. Yeah, come here, please. Describe an But he's ignorant. I'm mean, clearly ignorant. So, just be. He's not behaving respectfully. Look at how he's dressed with a fake beard and a. Because you feel like you got me, which is no problem. No, no, no. I no, no. got you not as in all. No problem, no problem. No, 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 no. No, no, no. But I want to explain. In your mind, because you have a beautiful mind, working you know, all over. But, but I want to show you something, though. But when it's an incomplete Jesus. point, I can't show you. So we can. You try to decide my mind, you're clever. Wait a minute. You so, said so, narration. Narration is Quranic, yes? Yeah, so Thank you. Quranic Therefore, narration has written down. Then Allah has made a claim that point. whoever. I have to make this point though, yeah? Because you're saying that thing that is written down that's been burnt, that thing that's written down that's been burnt has, could have scribal errors in it. That scribal error is not the word of God. I have to make this point clear. So, how did they make that scribal error? They made that scribal error because they're human beings writing it down when it's been. Ladies and gentlemen, it's not mutawatir. when I said to you earlier, is it mutawatir. possible? You, did, you refuse to say, yes, it could be. But the Uthmanic Rasan is that which is mutawatir and accepted by Ijma'. There's a distinction here. But individual parchments and manuscripts are not mutawatir. They haven't been verified. Yes. But the one Uthman of the Alarm and the Alarm was in the presence or not, of all the companions. Quranic, yes? They were Quranic. Quranic, but there's one Quranic which is Where is that? Where is that one Quran? That Quran is the one that we have today and that's presented by us. No, sir. The one that they the chest of Muhammad. That's the one that's come Where to is our it? Chest Where is well. it? I want it's to know it's in our hearts as well. No, sir. The one that came directly to Muhammad 
and he said it. Any Arabic Quran, Quran you pick up, any Arabic Quran you pick up. That's so, the same. So what do I compare it with? What do I compare it with? Where is the original? The original is. I'm doubting. I'm, ladies and gentlemen, I'm doubting. No problem. So, can you help That's me with fine. this? That's fine. Yeah. So if if you because you have to understand archaeology is is an inductive process right. so we haven't discovered all of the manuscripts and everything yes. so if you are relying solely on manuscripts i would refer you to the top top manuscript and the Birmingham manuscripts therefore it's justified my doubt yes i can doubt you can say and do what you want say so can you say you just trap yourself yes but you go back because it's called slippery slope. No, you said what can I compare it with? I've given you an old manuscript you can compare it with. Where is it? In Top Kapi in Turkey and the other ones in Russia. No, but how many pages, how many verses there? Top Kapi is 99%, only about two pages in this. Right, so that two pages is could be the, the answer to my No, but those, those two pages are found in the Sana'a manuscript. <laughs> right, so that is 100%. So they're all covered, yeah. <laughs> but why are you not producing it to the world? It is. It is. Where is it? I have a copy at home. It's called the Age of the Timeless Quran, which has got uh, it's got um, it's got one chapter with seven manuscripts, one above the other, yeah. comparing the writing. Okay. So you can see it yourself. So, all right. Can, we say give, you you've managed it, yes. I can give I you the book. that for the sake of argument. But how do I can we, give you this book, by the way? How do we know it's the word of I can, Allah? I can give you the book, by the way. No problem. You Thank you. How do we know it's the word of Allah? How do we know, sir? Yeah, so that I know was, you went to... No, that was the criteria I was discussing, but sometimes the tangents can become a bit longer. So one is you have to see if there's a claim. Like if you're comparing Harry Potter with the Quran, Harry Potter doesn't claim to be from God. Yeah, so you can't, anal yeah, you can't analyze the claim. Okay. The Quran does claim it's from God. First, you look at the claims in the Quran. You don't have to accept them as a, as a disbeliever or maybe as a believer. You don't have to accept them. But I think maybe you would agree that they are logical. If something's written other than God, it would have contradictions in it. If it's coming from no, Allah, Allah. Yeah. I'm saying, from Allah, from Allah. I'm saying no one could have written it, yeah? But why Allah? Allah is the name of God. So is it possible it could have been from another soul? Do you give that possibility to me? Look, if, if a creator, if you accept that there's a creator and that creator can be demonstrated and proved, he sent a prophet that can be demonstrated and proved, then it necessitates. Sir, I'm saying everything yes, but yes. how do we know it's from Allah? That's what I want to know. That's why I'm saying you analyze the But you didn't demonstrate, Muhammad. Yes, of course. No, you haven't. Yes. The miraculous nature of the Quran, in terms of numerical precision, in terms of structural precision, in terms of historical accuracy, let me no, give you sir, an example. It's let me give what you, was the first verse? Let me give you one example. Any miracle, yeah? Shall I give you one example? Please tell me what was the first. Shall I give you one example? You will give me later. Okay, no. What was the first? Ekra. Ekra, yeah? Where is Ekra? Where do you find Ekra? What do you mean? It should have come the first chapter, wouldn't it? It, it, is in the, it is in the first uh, chapter. chapter it There's it? one chapter yeah. which is regarded as the first in terms of revelation, yeah. chronology, okay. and there's another in terms of the Mus'haf. Okay. So, Ikra, yes? Good. And bear in mind, I also told you, I also told you that revelation came circumstantially. Okay. But you did not say, ladies and gentlemen, Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim, yes? Yeah. Why didn't you say that? Because Bismillah wasn't the first revelation. Thank you. At this is honor. So, Bismillah was made by. No, Bismillah is in the Quran, by the way. No, it's not. It, is it has Quran. never been. It is in the Quran. Sir, when you I'm use telling you, it's in the Surah. It's in the Surah. It's in, it's in a Surah. No, it's later. It, it has come to. But it's in the Quran, though. Yes, but who stood it there? No, it's part of revelation. I'm saying it says, Look, yes, it, is. it doesn't say, yeah, It doesn't come there. Why? Well, why does it need to come there? So, okay, when, when you say your hand, 
Why do you say Bismillah? Because the Prophet ﷺ told us to, but we don't believe that that's part of the Quran. You see, we justify everything I've asked. We justify justification. Let me make one thing clear. Yeah? When it comes to, because I understand the point that you're trying to make, it's maybe a missing me slightly. The word Bismillah is actually in front of every chapter. Yeah? What he's saying is that should be the first revelation and stamps that was added in. My point is that Bismillah Rahim is not something that is alien to the Quran. Bismillah Rahman Rahim is actually included in the Quran in a different surah. However, reciting Bismillah Rahman 